Here we have the STS PKM mount. This version has a large pintle. We also have a small pintle for use on a swing arm. To install this to the Mark 38 stand, simply insert the large pintle into the Jeep socket and then rotate and lock it into place. For additional information on the Mark 38 stand, refer to the other videos. Now that we've mounted the STS PKM mount into the Mark 38 stand, the next step is to mount the weapon system. Take your clear and safe PKM machine gun, take the forward mounting lugs, rotate them down into the front portion of the mount, pull rearward, push forward on the rear locking lever, drop the machine gun all the way down, and release the lever to lock the PKM machine gun into place. Now you've effectively mounted the weapon system to the mount. Here we'll discuss taking the PKM ammunition can and loading it into the ammunition can holder. Simply take a fully loaded ammunition can, push it down into the friction locks into place. You'll notice this ammunition can holder is permanently affixed to the mount. From here, if you need to reload the ammunition can, you don't necessarily need to remove it. You can rotate the lug up, lift the lever, and you can reload the ammunition can. After the can has been reloaded and into place, from here you can bring it up and load the weapon system. The PKM also has a tall ammunition can, which will fit into the ammunition can holder. To remove the small can, simply push up against the friction locks, remove the small ammunition can, take the tall one, push it down against the two friction locks, Rotate the locking lug on the ammunition can, load the ammunition can with ammunition, and load the weapon system. Now that we've mounted the PKM machine gun to the PKM mount, I'd like to point out there are no train stops or travel locks on this mount. Instead, while free gunning the weapon system, there are two friction levers. The first is here located at the bottom of the mount. This friction lever controls the lateral movement of the weapon system by applying tension while moving the weapon. The top lever controls the friction in both depression and elevation. As I apply the friction here, it allows me to control how much I can move the weapon system. From there, this device allows you to ratchet and move the handle into a position that best suits the gunner to apply that friction.